سلام بهمن آزاد کوردینیتور اف دی کوالیشن اگینست یو اس فارن ملیتری بیسز وی ار هیر فرست اف اول این سپورت اف هیروجی اول ویت یو هیروجی اول دی وی اند وی ار هیر تو اپوز یو اس فارن ملیتری بیسز اسپیشلی ان اوکیناوا بیکاز دی هاف کمیگریت ا لوت اف کرایمز ا لوت اف پرابلمز and they are causing tension around the world with those bases. So we are asking for the closure of all U.S. foreign monetary bases in the world. Oh, you're the Australian folks. We're, we're part of the Granny Peace Brigade, and we are here to thank them for leading the opposition all this time, for risking going to prison, hard labor. This is not the reward they should have. They have been so brave and courageous. The opposition to the base has gone on since 1997. We should not be there. The United States should not have a base in the local game. So we want to thank them and we will continue to support them. I know they're out on bail now. But when they go before the judge, we want that sentence to be ended. They should be free. That's why we're here. Hello, my name is Alice Sturm Sutter, and I am in the Raging Grannies and many other groups. And we came here to support the people from Okinawa. I'm very sad to say that the United States has bases all over the world. We have military bases that cause so much damage to the people who live there. We're hurting people, we're provoking war. It's wrong. And I want to give support to the people in Okinawa who are brave enough to protest the bases. I give them such credit, they're so courageous. And we need them free. Please don't put those people in jail. They do not belong in jail. They're the people we need to create a better world. We need a better world desperately. So please let them go. Please, please. Thank you. Okay. Hi, my name is Bernadette Ellerin. I am with Bayan USA. And uh, we are a Filipino-American alliance. And uh, the Filipinos in the U.S. and in the Philippines stand in solidarity with the people of Okinawa who are struggling against U.S. Uh, imperialist intervention in the form of military bases and aggression in their territory. Uh, we uh, are inspired by the steadfast dedication and commitment of the Okinawan people to stand their ground and their commitment to peace in the region. So um, we are with you and we will stand side by side with you until victory. Thank you. Hi, uh, I'm Naz Martinez. I'm with Bayan USA and I'm here to support um, the Okinawa activists um, as they continue facing same repression. It's very similar to what's going on in the Philippines. I, um, where they, um, there in the Philippines, activists are also facing um, trumped up charges just like um, the Okinawa activists. Uh, our struggles are really one and the same. We are facing the same uh, U.S. imperialists. All they really care about is continuing um, protecting their own their own wealth, and um, they don't really care what they do, what they have to do to get it. Um, may be destroying the coral reef in the Okinawa, um, pushing people out of their lands, and I really feel for um, the Okinawa peace advocates and whatnot because it's we're one in the same, we're doing the same thing, and we're fighting it. We just happen to be in different countries, so um, stay strong, and I hope y'all are doing well. <laughs> Hi, my name is Juyan. I'm from Noduto uh, in New York City. I'm a part of the Korean community that is standing for peace and anti-basis. Um, our comrades from Okinawa, we stand in solidarity with all the efforts to get rid of the U.S. militaristic attempt and advance to occupy our indigenous land and ancestral rights. And if we unite, I, I understand that there is an inter-island solidarity among Koreans and Okinawans. And with this solidarity and alliances that we are working with, I am confident that we will be able to drive out the U.S. military. 
and we can achieve the permanent peace in our hands. Today. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Message is clear and loud. No troops in Korea, and Korea is one. Okay. Hello. My name is Marie, and I am here because I am from Vieques, Puerto Rico, and I believe that militarization is never the answer, and I believe that militarization has to be stopped. And I support anti-militarization movement throughout the world and the people of Okinawa in their struggle for peace. Bob Kyle back from Veterans for Peace. We're here to protest uh, for the U.S. bases in Okinawa. It's, uh, the U.S. Had, has too many bases all around the world. We need to bring, bring the war money home, spend it at home where it belongs. Thank you. No base in Okinawa have voted in referendum. That no bases should be in in Okinawa, so we should bring the war money home. Spend the money here. Thank you. Hi, my name is Linda Novensky, and I'm a Veteran for Peace uh, supporter and associate. And um, I'm here to support the people who are trying to get Hiroji a fair uh, hearing, and he should be released immediately. He's already spent five, five months, five months uh, with no charges or, or no conviction, and, and it's time for peace. Peace in Okinawa, peace in Japan, and peace in the world. No to nuclear weapons and no to prosecuting people for wanting peace. Thank you. My name is uh, Jerry Hassett. I'm with the Veterans for Peace. And it may be very simple, I'm here for humanity. But a lot of Vets for Peace have been over to Okinawa trying to stop stop this. And uh, let's ho hope and pray that we get something done. That this is uh, it's just terrible. Okay, my name is Tracy Gross. I'm with Veterans for Peace. And uh, I'm here because uh, as a member of Veterans for Peace, we advocate uh, against war wherever it is, but we also are against uh, U.S. bases in other countries, and uh, we support the people in Okinawa that are protesting and that have protested for a long time, and uh, we want you to know that we are with you.